APD says the man who was shot and killed by officers last night fired at them first with a stolen gun. We now know where it came from. News 13's Lizé Mitri is live at San Mateo in Constitution with the story. Lizé. Jessica Dean, after police shot the suspect here in this busy neighborhood, they got a closer look at his gun and bulletproof vest that they say belongs to a fellow law enforcement officer. Police first got to San Mateo and Constitution around five last night looking for two suspected thieves. Police took one into custody with no problem, but say this man, John O'Keefe, ran. Witnesses saw it too. I saw someone running down the street. Um, then I saw a series of police officers on a very high speed chase. Police say O'Keefe shot at officers on two different occasions during the foot chase through the neighborhood before two officers fired back, killing him. It was really kind of scary and nerve wracking. O'Keefe has been in and out of jail since 2000 for drugs, stealing, battery, and armed robbery. APD says this is the gun and bulletproof vest he used the night of the shooting, both confirmed stolen from a Bernalillo County Sheriff's deputy. BCSO says the deputy was at work Monday when someone broke into his house and took them. They do have serial numbers, and so we were able to, to trace that and confirm that it was, in fact, uh, his body armor. BCSO says the gun, though, was the deputy's personal weapon, and he had two others stolen that night that police haven't found yet. We don't know at this point if that act or that burglary was specifically targeted towards law enforcement or if they just saw a house, decided to go in. Court records show O'Keefe was most recently arrested just before Christmas for failing to show up for a traffic ticket. He bonded out the same day. That means he'd been out of jail for about three weeks when the shooting happened. Back to you. All right, thank you, Lizé. Police are still trying to figure out if O'Keefe is a thief who broke into the deputy's home or if he just ended up with the gun. The guy who was with O'Keefe before the shooting has not been charged with anything yet.